Hello beautiful Geminis. Welcome back to the channel everybody. I'm hoping for some really good news for Gemini. I know you guys have been through it so let's get going. Beautiful Geminis. What's coming in for the beautiful Geminis? What can Gemini expect to see, know, or hear? Gemini. The moon. Pay attention to your intuition at this time and move ahead confidently. Gemini. Ooh, this one. Chariot. Charge ahead with confidence. Stay strong and stay focused. Gemini. Sun. Open your heart to the enormous growth that's ahead. Yeah, a time of natural transition and transformation. So some <coughs> communication here. Something may have, uh, you may be going through a transformation. Something may have come to an end in your life, but you've trusted your intuition. You stay focused, move ahead, stay strong. Because there's a bunch of happiness coming in. The key, a new beginning, direction, adventures await for those who are ready to let go of the past. And that's just the way it is, Spirit says. Gemini. What about Gemini? Magic. Make a wish. Believe in miracles. Magic is all around you. A celebration. A positive outcome is assured. Celebrate your success. Enjoy your achievements. There is support here. Ask for help. Get more rest or nurture yourself. Passion. Do what excites you. Get fired up about your life and increase your energy levels. Patience. Pause before you take action. Trust in divine timing is at work and be patient and play while you wait. That's all you can do. Intention here. Be clear and decisive. Focus on what you really want. Be bold with your request to the universe so don't be afraid to ask for a miracle or magic or whatever it is but i can tell you be get fired up about your life nurture yourself i'm you might be in need of more rest here gemini let's see what's going on for no spirit saying this one what about Gemini? What can uh, Gemini expect in the near future here, Spirit? What about Gemini? I like the fact that there's magic all around you. I like the fact that you'll be celebrating. I do like the fa fact that you're getting patient, passionate about life again. Because there's a lot of growth ahead of you. Patience here. Courage. Stay strong. Get grounded. Stay grounded. Independence is here. Hmm. Water. Yeah. You could have gone through a lot, like a lot of emotional uh, scars and stuff like that, but Spirit is telling you to stay courageous, stay grounded, uh, remain independent and be patient because there's a lot of growth ahead of you peace and home <laughs> yeah a revelation get fired up about your life there might be silence going on at this time but be patient yeah 
there's very little hope for this past situation something has ended um everything has been revealed okay and adopt the attitude of gratitude you were done a favor this is destiny and nobody can alter destiny destiny is destiny for whatever reasons just know you have sun ahead of you and expect some kind of um, be patient because things are get excited about your life that's what it's telling you stay courageous and just know it's like you need to raise your vibrations maybe you're not resting enough or sleeping enough do your prayers and initiate something yeah keep moving forward keep going forward spirits adamant about it because this person may never make a decision the past person may never make a decision i don't know or you have made a decision or the decision has been made but it was destined to happen because you're being offered a new world here and it's going to be full of happiness and growth and this person looks a little happy to be free to be honest with you patience <laughs> easier said than done right but spirit saying don't be shy and asking for what it is you want from the universe make your intentions very clear what it is that you want and do your prayers i want to say if you've recently lost somebody know that this person wants you to move forward i'm feeling that very strongly um i am indeed it's a natural transition that somebody has experienced not just like in a it could have been a romantic situation that came to an end but i'm actually feeling like it's an actual person who has passed away and they want you to keep moving forward they're telling you to keep moving forward there's a new world be grateful be grat be initiate do what is passionate for you in your life if you moved on from a romantic situation keep a moving forward don't look back Ooh. Hmm. Hmm. So it's almost as if This is odd. This is odd. So just hang on, clarify this. Uh, Page of Pentacles, King of Pentacles, initiating action, scared. What's going on here? Please clarify this. Something was unjust. There's like collaboration here. What is this saying? I 
I'm picking up another energy here. It came out together. Somebody is moving on. Because somebody initiated something somewhere else, but... Something here was unjust with a business or with finances here or an inheritance or something like that. It could have been a court judgment or a court ruling. Somebody initiated something to do with the courts here. Someone was scheming. This is different. We usually get... Well, I know it's also to do with romance, but there's a court in somebody is something to do with business. It's something to do with a court uh, payout and somebody is moving on. Hmm. hmm. See this? What is this all about here? This is odd. This is a big change from what has been coming in your reads. I do indeed. Someone is making... Okay... Somebody is making a plan to move on from a third party and they want to move toward their empress and give them the attention and honor and seize the empress as their wish fulfillment. They want to offer love, commitment and work on something on a long-term situation with their divine partner. Oh my God. But they were in a third party. Guys. And now they're, somebody took them to court. There's been a settlement. And th this person is moving away from the third party toward their divine partner <laughs> and spirit is saying there's been silence between you <laughs> you may really want to second guess this one because you really better think on this one it's going to be your decision yep because the shit has hit the fan. The shit hit the fan with the third party. And now they've gone to court. There's been some sort of payout or settlement. And now they want to come toward their divine partner. Offer them love, commitment and to work on things. I don't know. Karmic cycle completion. The karmic situation is done for. And now they want a new opportunity. Oh, jeez. Oh, yeah. I don't know if they're coming charging in to fight for something or they're angry that the tower hit. But they're looking... Feel in the consequences, want to speak the truth about something that was hidden, offer an apology. What? The Emperor? Paying out. What's going on here? They're defensive, they're wounded about the past. 
Well, they were breadcrumbing the past person, that's obvious. But I think they may have had to pay out for children if there was children involved. And then they're getting the hell out of there. Mm -hmm. And they're looking at all the money that they had to spend along the way. They're thinking about the past person. And they're coming toward the past to rebirth something because that karmic situation has come to an end. Okay, yes. And now with the other lover, yes. Who was a karmic? It was a karmic cycle. They went to a karmic energy. Full of drama, conflict, indecision, blindfolded, blindsided. As above, so below. Oh my God, there's silence. What is going on here? <laughs> There's no celebration there. There's no commitment here. There's no marriage here. No business. It was not. It was a false twin flame union. It's a false twin that they went to. path they chose has fallen down. Hmm. Yeah. I don't know what this is. Could have been a distant uh, situation, like a long distance relationship or something that they, I don't know. Hmm. Something to do with uh, a heavy burden about something they block themselves off from this baby mama because why they were trapping them or lying it's, it's something to do with wanting to communicate uh, with their happiness or they thought that this was going to be their happiness but it was a trap it was a fake soulmate. It was a karmic soulmate. They had a divine union here. They've walked away. And now they want to come back. They're heartbroken. They got their heart broken. And now here is this. Jesus. They want to restart. They've had a brutal, painful ending. And now they want to heal things. This is destined. It was destined to happen. Why it was destined to happen is because they had a divine partner originally. And they skipped out on their divine partner, went to a karmic to be taught a lesson. They got taught a hard lesson, a very painful, hard lesson, just like they did to their divine partner. And now they want to restart it with their divine partner. They have had to invest or go to court and pay uh, for the children or child support or something like that. Or there was, it could have affected their finances or their business. Mm. 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 I think the juggler got juggled. Yes, I do. They went spying and saw something. Got left out in the cold. What? <laughs> they could have got uh, financially taken in. Yes, I do think that. Lied to. Manipulated. Yep. Told a bunch of lies. Created a bunch of stress. And they were being deceived. Mm-hmm. Well, it looks like as the cookie crumbles here, they got what they did to their divine partner. I'm not shocked, I'm not surprised, but it's been updated a bit. It's like they've actually been deceived. They've gone to court. I don't know what's going on here. Let's find out what's going on with this union. What's happening between this third party karmic and this person? What's going on? What happened here? What's going on? They were dealing with a thief. 
That's what they were dealing with, a thief. And they had a main female. And now they ended things with the main female. Something has happened. They were stole from their in poverty. They were dealing with a thief who then ended things with them. Took them for what it, a ride. Took them for what they, everything they got. I don't know if they married this person or not. Or they found out that this person was married. I don't know. It was for money. A great fortune. Oh, that's too funny, that is. You know what they did? It was a trap to... Uh, they figured that this person was a wealthy man. I don't know what they did if they got ghosted and then this karmic took all their money and then married another wealthy man or something. I don't know. That was the intention of the karmic to steal, get married so they could rob this person of their finances. And it's kind of looking like they did. And now they're thinking of their divine feminine, who is the main female who has a great fortune. How do they know that? I think that this somebody over a house, they are in poverty because of a house they were dealing with a thief I don't know what's happening but this karmic could go to jail I don't know for whatever yeah going to court mm. over this family situation got a message yeah yeah thought that they were dating somebody with high on what hmm their health might be affected by this false person. Just saying they were a thief. It was a it was a plan. Because the trick it was a plan. Oh my head's spinning so I know it's real. Uh, this person was the karmic was dealing with another masculine. They're finding out that the karmic was a thief. It was a setup to get this person's wealth and it's kind of looking like they did okay that's what it's looking like and now they're looking over here at their divine partner thinking ooh main female got a great fortune here well that's because the main female is getting a great fortune <laughs> how they know that I don't know might have been through work that this mean female got their great fortune just saying yeah things are over i don't care this person's energy just makes me ill yeah, now they got a bunch of concern about this privileged lady. Why? <laughs> wonder how they know. How do they know? This is what gets me. How do they know that this person has money? The main female is getting money. All right? A good fortune. It's a karmic blessing, obviously, from things that they did from working hard toiling and laboring, working for their money. They earned their money. Yeah. Hmm. Who they were dealing was with, with the whole community when they went with this person. Like, this person got around. There's an official person involved here. Yeah. Getting a message. To go to court. Because they were a false person. I don't know if they're getting arrested, the karmic or whatever. I'm just saying it's it's nasty energy. And I wonder how does this person know that you're getting this fortune? That's what I want to know. How do they know? They're gonna spy? 
hire a private investigator? What the hell? How does this person know? I'm going to ask that question because that's bugging me. That's really bothering me. How do they know? Like, if there's silence between them, how would they know? Tell me, Spirit, how does this person know? This other divine counterpart. How do they know that the main female is getting some sort of money? How do they know? How do they know this? That's bugging me. How does this uh, divine counterpart know that the main female is getting all this money? How do they know? How do they know? How do they know? Through spirit? Or a high priest? They knew about it through a collaboration. It could have been a male tarot card reader. Or they are the high priest. An intuitive. But it's looking like it was a collaboration. This is an investigator. When looking into something. And told them. Something about. If there are children. The investigator told them something about these children. Or it is about. There's an investigation. It's like I asked, how does, how does this person know, this divine counterpart know about the main female getting money or a fortune? They said because they were silent and were working. That's a private investigation. Private investigator. Hmm. How did this secretly at a distance? Some kind of court documents or legal documents the fuck it could be public record or something like that there's a snitch around somewhere they better not be I'm just saying is this person through work paying somebody for their services ah, yeah that's why told them hey don't ignore this this person got a financial blessing somehow and that's why they're moving to oh that's why spirit is saying be very cautious they're an opportunist see 
they're spying on the divine counterpart they're searching legal records they've hired a private investigator that's how they caught the karmic as well same private investigator caught the karmic doing something found out they were a thief found out that they had stolen something they were a thief it was something to do with some property or an inheritance or a house or something like that and the same investigator exposed the betrayal but also searching public records told this person about about this uh searching public records so if you owned a house or something like that oh my jesus people are sick paid paid an investigator to find what out they could hmm it's a member it's a legal it's a legal document or a legal transaction it is paying someone for this service it's a private eye Snoopy, that's why Spirit's telling you, if you are the Divine Feminine here, the main female, who probably has hit it lucky, I'd use extreme caution with this character because they're an opportunist. Yes, I do think so, or it wouldn't be here. Fortunately, you've been gifted with intuition. <laughs> you are getting miracles. You are going to be celebrating. But I am saying here that somebody hired like a private investigator that's why they want to come to their divine counterpart this person is a sicko I don't know maybe they need a job <laughs> don't know what are the motives spirit of this person yeah, it's a deception about a house, guys. In a distant horizon. And now they're in despair. They got taken to the cleaners. And it looks like for a house, or it looks as if it's they got swindled somehow on a real estate deal or a real estate transaction or something like that. This person, uh, I don't know, just saying. Here's the divine femme over here working their butt off, and now they got a bunch of concern. Yeah, mm -hmm. they do indeed. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. They're in despair, all right. That's why Spirit keeps saying uh, new beginnings, new directions. I'll wait for those who let go of the past. <laughs> because this person... They're in search of finances. I'm telling you right now, they're up against it. It's a warning from spirit. Be careful of any past people returning because their motive is money. Period. Take care, you guys. Good luck.